In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use your webcam both on OBS and on Discord or in any other program at the same time when you're streaming. My name is Tree and I make stream support videos. Stream smarter, not harder. Before I begin, I stream for Tuesday and Friday, 8 p.m. Central European time on twitch.tv slash free. Link is underneath in the description. Okay, so the first thing we want to do is download Splitcam. I will leave a link to this underneath in the description as there's two versions and I don't know what the other one does, but I would recommend this one. So grab the one from the description. And then here we see Splitcam and it says free download. For me, it says it in Dutch, even though my computer is in English, it's really confusing, but it says free download for Windows here. Click on that and download it. You probably know how to install it goes. Just click a couple times on okay and finish and install it on location you know what to do with installers right then what you do is you open a program uh, for me i open it and here if you go to video you can select a webcam we got the hd uh, pro webcam c920 <laughs> i got that one selected as you see it's on here and what we can do now if we go to obs and we add a camera we can actually add a new video capture device and a split cam like you see here. It's right in there. Hello? <laughs> so now the split cam is in here. What we need to do is we need to set the resolution type on custom. Otherwise you're not 1080p and it's really annoying. I'm gonna make it smaller real quick because otherwise you guys can't see it. <laughs> um, but what I did is I went to properties um, as you see here and you need to make sure that you set it on custom and then 1080p and then set it on highest FPS. Otherwise, it will be as small as it is right now. And um, now if I restore it, transform, um, reset transform, you will see it will just be full screen. <laughs> and that's kind of what you want, right? Full screen. Now we could also go to Discord. So it's here on OBS. I'm gonna like make it small really quick because otherwise you can't see the Discord. You can see that I'm in a Discord call uh, by myself, <laughs> but also with the camera. So that's really great. I did try it while showing in OBS and it dis did work, but then I realized that you guys can't see what I'm doing on my screen when there's a webcam there. So um, yeah, it does work. <laughs> the second way you can do it is using OBS as a virtual camera. So there's this button here, it says start virtual camera. And basically if I do that, now my uh, my output of OBS, even though I'm not streaming, is actually a webcam. So if I go back to um, Discord here, now I can select OBS virtual camera. And you will see that we get a guest streamception because it's gonna stream my desktop right now. As I said, this, to be the output of my webcam. So that's the second way of doing it. But then if you switch scenes, people will also see the switching scenes in Discord. So that's, if you like switching scenes in Discord, I guess that's nice. But maybe if you want to go to starting soon or something like that, and you don't want people in Discord to see that, but just your webcam, the split cam method is a better way of doing it that way. If you guys have questions about this, please leave them down below in the comments. You're welcome to ask them in my live streams as well. And for now, I'd like to send you to this playlist all about OBS tutorials. I'll see you there.